Runa, thank goodness. We delivered the antidote to Slitherbow, and from what we could gather on the way here, the Ulmorans have had the good manners to withdraw. Thank the gods they did. We would never have made it here in time. I'm told we have Runar and his comrades to thank for keeping the soldiers occupied prior to their retreat. They were preparing to come for you and Yishtola, it seems, when Runar rallied the villagers and pursued them out of Slitherbow. a while longer. No. No, I am all right. Somewhat heavy of limb, perhaps, but otherwise well, I assure you. I am glad to see you are all safe. When we realized where the soldiers were headed, we knew something had to be done. Do not see Master Matoya. She was with you, yes? What happened to her? <laughs> Spare me your riddles and speak plain. Where is Master Matoya? No. No. No, that cannot be. Why would she do such a thing? There's no other way. I... I cannot believe that she... That she... We must begin the search immediately. I will come with you! What are you waiting for? We must find her! She could be trapped, or hurt, or... She is alive, damn you! Forgive me for interrupting, but our scouts have apprehended an intruder. We thought perhaps he might be an associate of yours. Oh, look who it is. Wow, this is embarrassing. In my defense, they are surprisingly tenacious. So, what trouble have you gotten yourselves into this time? Well, well. What an intriguing turn of events. My condolences, by the way. It is never easy to lose the ones we love.
Well, she is dead, isn't she? Wishing it were otherwise will not make it so. That you should be indifferent to her loss is no surprise. But to us, she was a friend. The best of friends. You have something on your mind. What is it? Pray recount to us again that which thou witnessed in the ruins, omitting not the slightest detail. Flow. The teleportation magic she used to spirit us away from Uldar after the bloody banquet. I recall a similar gale in the tunnel before it took effect. Interesting. I thought I sensed a brief disturbance in the live stream. How reassuring to know it was not my imagination. I felt it only once, I should mention. Which would suggest she is still adrift on its currents. Then I fear she may yet be lost to us. For it was only by the grace of the elementals that she was plucked from that great ethereal river. Ah, very well. I'll go and fetch her. Perhaps a clear and unambiguous act of kindness will serve to win the trust you seem so determined to deny me. Yes, this place should serve well enough. Might I have a little space? I need to concentrate. Now then, what colour was her soul again? Ah, there you are.
done it. He's brought her back. Are you all right? <sighs> yes. Though I cannot imagine how. What happened? Thou didst invoke the power of flow, which thence did usher thy soul unto the life stream. to save the antidote, and after that... <laughs> I did something exceedingly reckless, for which you will just have to forgive me. <gasps> Master Matoya! Heavens, you're all right. I had nearly given up hope. Please, Renard, dry your tears. What would the others think if they saw you like this? Come now. Did you really think I would go gently into that dark night with so much left undone? So many mysteries left unsolved. you wish to say to me? A word of thanks, perhaps? Emmet Selk, the Asian of whom I spoke. Twas he who plucked thee from the live stream. I see. Thank you. Differences notwithstanding, you saved my life, and for that I am grateful. But let us turn our attention to more important matters, such as the Katana Ravel. You had better not have explored its depths without me. and the others should be pleased to see you in such uncharacteristically high spirits. Let us return to Fanoff, then, and discuss the coming expedition. <laughs> <laughs>